a cube of ice floats partly in water and partly in kerosene oil as shown find the ratio of the volume of ice immersed in water to that in coil kerosene oil and the specific gravity of kerosene oil is 0.9 and that of the ice is also 0.9 okay now let's say i do have uh, the total volume of the cube is v or uh, i can say this is my length x that is about the surface of the water and the total volume of the cube is let's say x all right and uh, fine now at equilibrium i can write mg of ice that is downward it will be equal to the v rho g due to water and v rho g due to oil so i can write mg of ice is equal to v rho g that is the buoyant force due to water plus buoyant force due to kerosene oil okay now i can also write that volume of ice the total ice will be equal to the volume that is submerged in water plus volume that is submerged in kerosene oil fine now i can write the mass of ice that is the total mass of ice can be written as volume into density of ice into g now for this the volume is the volume that is dipped in water into rho of water into g and this is volume that is dipped in oil into rho of oil into g so g is cancelled from all the sides the v is into rho of ice is given as 0.9 the v of water plus v of oil into 0.9 fine and we know this relation so i can substitute the value of v is from over here i get 0.9 v of water plus 0.9 v of oil is equal to v of water plus v of oil into 0.8 oh, this is sorry 0.8 fine so i get v of water is equal to v of oil so okay now this shows that the volume that is submerged in water is equal to the volume that is submerged in kerosene oil so the ratio of the volume that is submerged in water to that of kerosene oil is 1 is to 1 that is the answer